Hello, I am Ravi, a cloud support engineer here at the AWS office in Dallas. Today, I am going to show you how you can make sure that an AWS database migration service task is progressing. Let's get started. Check the status of your DMS task. After logging into the AWS management console, navigate to the DMS console. Select the database migration tasks tab. Here you can see all the migration tasks and their status. If a DMS task is running, then the status should be one of the following. Running during the full load phase, replication ongoing during the change data capture phase or ongoing replication phase of a CDC only task, load complete replication ongoing during a full load plus CDC task. If the status is one of these that I mentioned, then proceed to the next step. Monitor Amazon CloudWatch logs of the DMS task. While you are still in the database migration tasks page of the DMS console, select the DMS task. Choose View Logs. This redirects you to the Amazon CloudWatch console where you can view the log of the DMS task. When viewing your logs, refresh the logs and display the latest information with the timestamp. If you don't see any new messages in log after about 5 minutes, then proceed to the next step. Refresh the table statistics of your AWS DMS task. After you select the DMS task in the DMS console, select table statistics. During a full load, you can see an increase in the full load rows value and a change in the load state value upon refreshing the statistics. Similarly, during ongoing replication or CDC, you can see an increase in DMLs or inserts, updates and deletes and DDLs. For a test or development database where there is not much activity happening at the source database, you might not see any change in the task logs or table statistic counters. In this case, proceed to the next step to verify if there is a latency on the task. Monitor CloudWatch metrics for rows unloading and applying. While you are still in the DMS task page of the DMS console, select CloudWatch metrics. To monitor metrics during the full load phase, select full load from the drop down list. Monitor full load throughput row source shows a detailed picture of the rate at which AWS DMS can unload source data into the replication instance during the full load phase. Monitor full load throughput rows target shows the rate at which the rows are leaving the replication instance to commit to the target. To monitor metrics during the CDC phase of a task, select CDC from the drop down list. Monitor CDC throughput row source shows a detailed picture of the rate at which changes are captured from the source and moved to the replication instance during the CDC phase. Monitor CDC throughput row target shows the rate at which the changes are moved from the replication instance to the target. Monitor CDC latency source shows the latency between the source and the replication instance in seconds. Monitor CDC latency target shows the latency between the replication instance and the target in seconds. Finally, you can also query the record count on the target at specific intervals to confirm that the data is being migrated to the target. This interval varies based on the load on the source target and replication instances and the amount of data that is in a single record. If there is no latency observed on the task and no new log message in the task log, then enable debug logging using AWS command line interface. While the task is running and monitor Amazon CloudWatch logs of the DMS task as described in the step to monitor Amazon CloudWatch logs of the DMS task. So now you know how to make sure that a DMS task is progressing. Thanks for watching and happy cloud computing from all of us here at AWS.